Hey, 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 good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. Here we have a article, <clears throat> gag order placed on case involving Wells family, children, and state custody by our Ansley Daniel. Rogersville, Tennessee, WJHL, a gag order has been issued on the Child Protective Services case involving the sons of Donald Wells and Candace Bly. The order was issued by Juvenile Court Judge Daniel Boyd on October 26. It reads, all parties to this action are hereby prohibited from discussing this matter or children with the media or any other non-essential person, entity, and or uninvolved or disinterred parties and or persons. Randall Collier, the circuit court clerk for Hawkins County, said the original order was made in conjunction with others involving case matters, which are sealed due to juveniles being involved. Collier told News Channel 11 he was not sure when the original gag order was put down. Wells confirmed to News Channel 11 back in July that their older sons were taken by Child Protective Services, but he wouldn't give the reason. News Channel 11 reached out to the court-appointed attorneys for the Wells family about why a gag order was issued for the juvenile case since they are normally confidential anyways. One declined to comment and a response from the other has not, has not been received as of Monday. A request for context and clarification has also been sent, Judge also been sent to Judge Boyd, maybe? Don Wells was arrested in Hawkins County Court Monday morning on a charge of violation of probation. Wells was in court appearing on charges of driving under the influence, improper lane usage, financial responsibility, and having an open container, and others. Wells was later seen by News Channel 11's crew leaving the jail and speaking with his probation officer. He declined to comment on the, re on the arrest and release. So that, um, we knew there was a gag order. So, yeah, let's see. Important information. If you've been denied Social Security Disability, your time to appeal may be limited. Wolf, Williams, and Reynolds are specialists in Social Security Disability cases. They understand how the system works and will provide the expertise that you need. Get the Social Security Disability... In the past three days, deputies have arrested the father of missing five-year-old Summer Wells twice, the most recent being today while he was in court. Now, Don Wells was initially arrested Saturday on several charges, including driving under the influence. During an arraignment this morning, the judge appointed Wells a public defender and reset the hearing to February. While in court, uh, Wells was arrested for violation of probation. He was released on his own recognizance, meaning he did not post bail money, but pledged in writing to appear in court for all upcoming proceedings. News Channel 11's Ansley Daniel was in court today where Wells told the judge he has been working on his house and, in his words, things for welfare to get his boys back. Josh and Sarah, Donald Wells did appear for an arraignment here in Rogersville earlier this morning. He was here over those DUI charges from this past weekend. And while he was being arraigned, he was arrested again for violation of probation. We are working to determine what exactly he violated. However, a gag order has been issued on the Child Protective Services case involving he and Candace Bly's older sons. It was issued by juvenile court judge Daniel Boyd, and it reads, all parties to this action are hereby prohibited from discussing this matter or the children with the media or any other non-essential person, entity, and or uninvolved or disinterred parties or person. 
Wells confirmed to me back in July that their older sons had been taken by Child Protective Services, but he wouldn't tell me why. I did reach out to the court-appointed attorneys for the Wells family about why a gag order was placed on a juvenile court case, which is normally already kept confidential anyways. I did hear back from one who declined to comment, and I'm still waiting on a response from the other. In Rogersville, Ansley Daniel, News Channel 11. Both Don Wells and Summer's mother, Candace Bly, are set to appear in a recorded Dr. Phil segment this month and talk about their daughter's disappearance. The show recently released this promo, teasing the episode, but didn't give an exact air date. Five-year-old Summer Wells was reported missing by her family from her Hawkins County home June 15th. A Tennessee Bureau of Investigation Amber Alert remains active tonight, and the TBI continues to ask for credible tips. Call 1-800-TBI-FIND or email the address. Big chicken, me 